Hello Taurus, welcome to your tarot reading. This reading is going to be about whatever comes up for you. All right, so let's take a look. Uh, only take what resonates, what fits and makes sense. Whatever doesn't, just leave it on out. It may be a message for someone else. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos. All right, here we go for Taurus. Starting off here with Taurus energy. Okay. All right. So what I'm seeing here is there's someone here who you're either separated from Taurus. Okay. There's, there's this breakup here, the separation, this split, it does feel like there's some heavy feelings, heavy emotions, uh, around this person, around the situation. Okay. But I do feel like someone got caught here. Like someone wasn't showing the full deck. Someone wasn't being completely honest. And I feel like you really started to see clear here and decided to make the right decision for yourself. For some of you, it could have been letting go. For some of you, it was uh, making plans to put yourself first. I do feel like you are attracting new energy here. I see someone who's coming in. This is new. Uh, this is a new adventure. I see flirting. I see fun. I see excitement. I also see a lot of new plans being made, uh, Taurus here, in regards to dating, in regards to meeting someone, in regards to that flirtatious energy. I just see a lot of fun, but it comes out of a place where you've had time to heal, right? Get past the breakup. Okay, get past the heavy energy of someone here who was just really deceptive. Okay, this person was really sneaky. It's almost like you didn't see them coming. They were really good at that um, illusion here, right? Really good at that, uh, that picture that they painted. Now, when it comes to coming together, okay, you do have soulmate energy here. Remember, it goes back to fun, excitement, okay, that harvest, just enjoying it all, having a good time, like kicking your feet up. This is the energy here that I'm seeing for you, standing strong and in truth here, being practical, definitely attracting a deeper relationship. This is more serious energy. This is where it has that potential to continue to flourish, okay? A lot of healing going on as well. But yeah, you're moving forward. You have the world. So a lot of you right now may just be putting time into you. I do feel like this person, when they do come in, this person you're attracting, it's going to come in really unexpected and it comes in with a bang. Okay. Yeah. So this person will be playing around. Let's get a little bit more on this new person. Who you're attracting. Ooh. Okay. Okay. That one wanted to come out. All right. So I still feel like there's a healing period for a lot of you. I'm seeing someone here who was also in deep regret here. Show me the new person, the Taurus. Wow, reconciliation here. Moving forward, a new beginning. Someone is really sorry. They're thinking about their happiness here with you, wanting more of it, wanting to move forward. Look at it, but here's the guard, here's the block, here's the chaos, here's that vulnerability. Someone here is very exposed. Everything's out in the open now. You keep getting this energy of someone here who wants to pop up and tell you they're sorry. need to know yeah this is someone who hurt you betrayed you the energy here is moving on self-love self-care focusing on that balance right focusing on what you deserve focusing on that harvest here you will have options Taurus but I feel like the most important thing is that feeling is you is your growth here someone is going to try to reconnect I do see someone trying to come back 
wanting to come together, wanting to reconcile, wanting another chance. Again, this is for only uh, those of you who uh, are in this situation and it resonates now. You have two people here. You have someone who can be very caring, who loves to provide, who is generous, who is successful, but also someone who's, this is more mental, someone who is more practical, uh, firm in their emotions, okay? They're, they, they're not too emotional, but this person is, is very intelligent with how they handle situations and how they look at things and what needs to be done, okay? This is someone who can be very fair. This is someone who is very balanced. This is someone who likes to do the right thing, okay? But I feel like there was someone here who just loved to promise and promise. But again, they fell short. This is that person who caused hurt here. This is that person where it felt like there was always something going on because it was really sneaky energy, Taurus. This person may try to come back, but there is someone else here. So let's get a little more, okay? More messages here for you. So you have Cancer here, you have Virgo, Gemini, Taurus, Sagittarius, <clears throat> all right, life is too short, focus on what you can achieve and not on what you haven't. So. For those of you who are in this weird period with someone where either it's over, you broke up, things came out, or you're separated or unsure, life's too short to focus on the things that you know aren't worth uh, your time, your energy, okay? Focus on what you can achieve here. In these cards, it's that happiness, it's that success, it's that romance, it's that positive energy, it's that person who's going to do right, want to do right, want to do their part so important right when it comes to being on the same page here right not wasting your time giving someone a chance after chance after chance when they continuously show you where they're coming from who they are here it feels like you have given someone here many times over and i feel like this is a time of new opportunity new growth for you and not focusing on what didn't work out what could have worked out what should have worked out but what's still possible moving forward, moving ahead. Okay. Serious energy there because there is still happiness here on this table, as well as a lot of important things to know, right? When it comes to someone who broke your trust or betrayed you, this card is not only about moving forward Taurus, but it's about, it's about your courage. It's about your confidence. It's about enduring moving forward, moving through those challenges. It's about strong will. There will be that abundance here. Whatever it is that you're trying to create, whatever it is you want to achieve. This is not only about having options and an abundance of love as well. It's all of those things. Those are the wonderful things to focus on, right? Especially self-love. Just taking care of you. Let's see. What else? I'm seeing partnership here when it comes to work, when it comes to career, staying focused on your talent, your potential, knowing that you can do it, being confident, determined, looking at the fine print, looking at things that you really need to look at here when it comes to making decisions. Oh, there we go. Ooh. So this is why that energy keeps popping up. Someone here is still very clingy and still holding on. Like they still want to like have you locked down. Talents and gifts. Someone here is really talented at trying to give or trying to provide or kind of just do something nice when they mess up here. This could just be the new person here who is very giving. 
there's an abundance here of happiness, of love, romance, friendship. But know your talents, know your skill. There may have been something here that didn't work out, okay? But there's a new opportunity for you. Okay, what else? Let's get a message, okay? Someone finds you beautiful, so attractive. They feel pulled to you. But someone's hoping it isn't too late. See, there's that energy. They're still clinging. They want that lock to close. Right now it feels like they're holding on, but it's not closed, but they're holding on as long as they can. They're hoping that they can still hold on. But for you, I feel like you guys aren't wasting any time here. There's so much more here that you are meant to receive the gift of love. The talent, the potential to know how to move forward in love. Someone's waiting for you to reach out. Playing that waiting game. It's time to leap out of the darkness and into the light filled with positivity. There it is, that happiness, that 10 of cups. It's time to experience this. It's time to jump into this. A lot of you are planning, thinking. Trust yourself. Trust this process, everything that's playing out. Trust your feelings and listen to that voice within. Absolutely. Look at this. Keep talking about abundance, right? You have blessings that are coming in. This is what you're calling in. So look out for blessings in disguise, right? Life is too short to focus on that spilled cup, to focus on what happened. This was meant to happen. When someone tries to cling, when someone tries to hold on, it's because they know they have a good person. They had a good thing. Life is too short to waste your energy, your love, okay? Your time when you have blessings meant to come in. Sometimes it does take a leap, a leap of faith, trusting yourself through this process. Don't forget to dream because a lot of you are going to be achieving a lot here and a lot of you are making some really big plans. I see you guys being successful, getting things in motion, Okay, let's keep going. All right. Reconciliation. Look at that. My goodness. <laughs> Very strong here. This person misses you. There's sweetness here. It feels like there's someone coming in who just it's like they give you that they give you that nurturing energy like they just it's 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 delicate it's gentle it's nourishing like it fills the soul it truly does feel like a gift eternity there's a flame here passion desire there's a connection here meant to last important friendships, important partnerships here. You're building something that is going to last here right now. You may be in the planning stages, but there's sweetness here to have like it's yours for the taking. This is a time of renewal, a time of healing. Yes, there's been some thorns. Yes, there's been some hardship. 
But this is all about your achievement and moving forward and receiving what you want, your dreams, your goals, your vision. What else? When those tower moments happen, Taurus, it can be very intense, but it's something that you never forget. Like it leaves that lasting impression because it is life changing. It, I mean, it is a major event when you see things start to roll out, when you when someone truly reveals themselves. Changes focus, right? From bittersweet to sweetness. This is the gift here. This is the blessing here. It's a blessing in disguise. All right. Someone didn't fall in line, didn't do right. The walls are up high. This is someone who can be very manipulative here. One more. But you're letting go. You're letting go. You're taking flight. This is a time of transformation here. Change. Big change. spiritual connection all right this is the kind of relationship that is truly special like you're truly connected to someone okay it's like the two of you can just really feel each other sense each other read each other okay like you just know like you know how that person's feeling they know how you're feeling they know it's like you can't get away with anything because you two are that truly connected to each other i feel like this is what you're attracting this is a beautiful gift to have that type of connection it is very spiritual it's very pure intense real sincere life is too short to focus on what you cannot change on what has happened for purpose for reason so you can achieve and enjoy that sweetness okay that's the energy here in this reading not focusing on what hasn't worked but what can and what will be mindful here of someone who is trying to cling and hold on very tight here Okay, so that's what I have for you. Taurus, thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe. Don't forget to comment down below. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye.